Hello everyone and welcome to Cooking with Paul King. Today we'll be making blini or Russian pancakes. Um, why? Because I'm hungry and fat. Let's get started. Okay. So, uh, to begin we need... I'm just, uh, let me get to just uh, let me get stuff first. Okay, uh, to begin with we will need uh, four eggs. Yes? Put in four eggs into this... Uh, Oh damn, I'm not good at English. Buckety thingy here. It shouldn't be much of a problem. It's just opening eggs, right? Just and oops, and also one. If you're a Sigma male, you can probably even open eggs with one hand. Just like Oh, holy shit, it worked! Oh, 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 did you see it? Oh! Look at that! I'm amazing. I, I actually prepared the joke that if you're a Sigma male, you can do that and then I would fail. But then, okay. Yeah, that, that, that you, you shouldn't do. Okay, I... I got carried away. I am. Yeah, four, four eggs, and actually, let me, actually, let me get one more, because uh, for some reason I have small eggs, didn't pay attention or something, they just, you can't work with small eggs, small eggs are just cringe. So we'll just add one more, yes, fine, great, good, good. Four eggs, or you know, five if you have tiny balls like me. Um, next thing we will need to do is a little bit of salt. My favorite type of salt is the salt of tears of inferior gacha game players like Genshin Impact or Azure Lane. Their tastes are quite salty. Just put in a bit of salt in there. Not too much, and then three or four. This is a tablespoon, right? Yeah, okay, yes, yes, it's a tablespoon. Three or four tablespoons of sugar. One, two, three, four, and a bit more because. I like sweet things. And last but not least, a bit of milk. A bit of milk. And then we have to start beating the living shit out of this bitch. A bit of milk. And... It would actually... Um, no problems here. Actually, while we are beating the shit out of the thing we just created, we're gonna turn on the... No. It's not an oven. Or heaty pan thing. I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna turn it on a bit because it will be helpful if our pan will be hot. Let's just put the pan on there already. Oh, oh. Oh. Smart. Nice. Let the pan get a bit hot. Okay. So. Right now, I am mixing our eggs and our milk and our sugar and our salt. There's not too much that needs to be mixed. But now we will have to add something else, mainly around 200 grams of flour, 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 flour. not flour, flour, you know what I mean, the, the wheaty thingy, and uh, uh, three tablespoons of oil, 
Unfortunately, I don't have a scale, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna... Use a small cup instead, you know, like, like uh, this cup will fill half of it, could probably be around 200 grams, I think. This looks like 200 grams, right? I'm sure it does, yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna put that bitch in there. And then we'll add three tablespoons of sunflower or whatever the fuck rubs in English is oil. I have sunflower oil. So I'm just gonna add three tablespoons. Ah, it's fine. Yeah, this is yes, three, three. That's good. That's good. We're doing everything right so far, and now we have to beat that bitch up. If you're smart, you will beat it up in a way that things don't start jumping out of there. But I am not smart. Okay, we're almost done. The final step now is adding more milk until we've achieved the right consistency. You might be asking, Polky, what is the right consistency? How much milk do we have to add? I don't know. I made these things like once, a couple of months ago. I forgot, just... <sighs> we're, just we're just gonna find out together, right? we will find out together. Bit of milk. And start mixing again. <laughs> Oh, this feels not too bad. Not too bad. I'm gonna say this is fine. Actually, no. Let me add a bit more milk to it. Something, oh, something like this, right? Should look something like this, consistency-wise. Liquid, but not, but not too much, right? Not too much. Okay, and now comes the, uh, now comes the important part, the actual. So the pan is hot, that is good. Um, we will now have to add our liquid mass into the pan. Uh, do I have any kind of good... Uh, I think I do. Mm. Nope. Proportion is important. Uh, because unlike pancakes, you might know, blini are actually supposed to be quite thin. Not, you know, they like good chunky and nice pancakes, but blini are supposed to be thin boys, so you have to be careful how you're doing things. How am I gonna film this and cook at the same time? I don't know. Alright, you should be able to somewhat see things. And now we're just gonna get our mass and put it in there nicely. Making sure it's spread out and not too thick. Ah, oh, that doesn't look too bad. Maybe the pan is a little too hot, so we're gonna reduce heat and then we will remember that we have to put them somewhere, so we're gonna get a fucking plate out here. 
Very nice. I'm just gonna put this behind it, okay? And yeah. Now we'll get a, a fork. You might wanna do it in another way because if you use a fork, you can scratch your pan. I don't know how to do it differently, so I'm gonna use a fork. Because the thing is, you know, if you did it somewhat correctly, you will now have it spread out like this. And then you start removing removing the edges so you can flip it around I hope you can see anything I don't know if you can gonna have to put you down again now because I will need my hands and I'm just gonna let this bad boy gonna be a bit hot throw it around yeah and make sure you're getting Well, apparently um, uh, I don't have enough uh, space left on my phone to record. I try to delete some things, but this is gonna be a probably very cursed video, even more cursed than I thought it would be. And possibly it fucking burned at this point. Let me quickly get it off there. I took too long. Oh, it definitely. Oh, it definitely burned. Oh, goodness gracious, that's. That, you see that? That's not how it's supposed to look. Ah, ah, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up. But it's too... Like... How does it saying go? Three is a... Some, something about three. Third, third time's the charm. That's what they say. You know, quickly put it in there. Spread it out. Spread it out. Mm, this one. This one is gonna be good. I can feel it. I can feel it. This one's gonna be great, guys. Trust me. Trust me. This is gonna be probably the first good one we're gonna have. No. Wait a bit. <laughs> and roughly about. Now you can start turning it around. one is gonna be nice mm, you see just like that just like that that's how it's supposed to go let me just check if you're still recording oh it looks like it I'm doing it. okay okay yes oh that was hot um, and yeah once they're all done you can get yourself some nice jam or Nutella honey whatever put it on there oh, oh. This is how it's supposed to go. Mm. And there we go. Some bleeding. Just like Babushka used to make them. Now all we're gonna do is put on some jam. Mm. Fold it. Oh. And enjoy.